Hello everyone. So today I am back to do my final thoughts on Crepe Erase. So Crepe Erase is a skincare system, most notably being touted by Dr. Quinn Medicine Woman, aka Jane Seymour, and it came with quite a few things. So you had the body scrub, you had a little facial scrub, then you had some eye cream, it's probably upside down, and some facial serum, <clears throat> and the Crepe Erase lotion for your body, and I also got the lip kit which comes with a refining lip polish and intensive lip treatment. So you're probably wondering how this worked out for me and I wanted to be fair and give this product several weeks to use before I made up my mind and I have to say I'm just really not that impressed with it. Um, I will pop up some reviews. I haven't found um, a lot of reviews where people really like the product. And for me, this is the one really great thing is for the dry skin on my legs. Otherwise, this is like putting on Crisco or some other cooking oil and it doesn't really rub into your skin or go into your skin really well. So after you put it on, you're kind of like a little greased pig just running around and it's hard to touch things. You can't get into your phone. Things fall out of your hands and it just kind of sits on top of your skin without really soaking in. So... I wasn't really impressed with that. And I have to say, I more bought it for the facial eye treatment to see if there was anything different. And I have a before picture and I will also pop up an after picture. I just think the Neutrogena face cream I have or the oil of Olay I have gotten in the past, I think all of those work a lot better. I actually haven't seen any difference and again I've been reading through the reviews a lot of people can't tell any difference and this is depending you can get it on special for $34.99 but you have to sign up for auto ship and my feeling on auto ship is if your product is that good I will want to order more for myself you don't have to strong arm me into sending it to my house and then I forget to cancel it and then you get like a couple more shipments out of me before I find the number and spend three hours on hold to call in and cancel. So for me, this one is a no. This one is a pass. Again, I really like the Crepe Erase Cream because my legs get just freakishly dry. I don't really know how else to describe that. And I did find that um, this keeps my legs from getting all dried out and itchy. But other than that, I have used regular dollar store hand lotion on my face in a jam. I know you're not supposed to do that. Um, that has worked better than this product. I didn't see um, my skin firming. I did not see my skin tightening. In fact, my skin still looks exactly the same. Um, I didn't do a before and after shot on my arms or my legs or anything because you literally can't tell the difference. Um, just still kind of looks um, a little tad dried out on my legs. My arms are okay. I have pretty soft skin and I finally gave up and went back to using um, my hemp lotion so on my arms and on my hands. So unfortunately, this isn't it, which is very disappointing because Dr. Quinn Medicine Woman, y'all, I just didn't think she would lead me astray. So 
that's a little disappointing, but hey, everybody's got to earn a living. So on this one, if you have seen the ads, I saw this on Instagram, thought I would give it a try. I think anything that you can buy at your CVS, Rite Aid, Walmart, any kind of lotion, I think is going to work a little bit better, if not exactly the same, and it's going to be a whole heck of a lot cheaper. So that is my final thoughts on Crepe Erase, but don't you worry, I have already ordered a different product off Instagram, which I will be talking about next week, because that's what I do. I order questionable items off the internet and try them out so you don't have to. All right, everyone, that is my final thoughts on this product. It is two thumbs down, and thank you for watching, and as always, I will see you in the next review.